Alrighty, so I am doing a little bit of a training video because of a, a challenge that I had uh, in terms of uh, Facebook's ability now to stream from Zoom into Facebook groups. They've removed that. The, the API is no longer working, and so that update is causing a bit of challenge for people who, like myself, do this on a regular basis. So if this is something that you would find valuable, uh, then watch this uh, quick training, and I'll, I'll show you how to do it. So there are a few steps, but it's still possible to actually stream from Zoom to Facebook. It's just a wee bit different. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Uh, you're going to need access to your Zoom account uh, and also to your Facebook account. And we're just going to set up a stream key and, and make it possible. So the first step, we're going to go into your... Uh, Zoom account. So let's screen share so you can see exactly what's going on here. All right, we'll just do a desktop share and that'll make it simple. And I can go between uh, a couple of different things. Alrighty, so in your Zoom account, on the left side, you want to scroll down until you get to account management. And under account management, account settings. And then you want to make sure you're under the, the meetings tab here. And you can start to type in here or you can just scroll down. But basically we're going to the live streaming section. Let's see if it takes us there. There we go. All the way down to the bottom basically. You want to make sure that this is turned on. And then you've got two components that are essential. You likely already have... Facebook turned on so make sure that's there and also make sure that the custom live streaming service is turned on and you don't necessarily need to put anything in here that's just in case you want some extra instructions and then click save and so that's like a big component that you need to make sure you have in place before you even go over to Facebook to to set up your your streaming key and then also, if you have any uh, meetings set up, it would be good to check and make sure that that custom streaming is available. So I've got one coming up right away here. So I'm just going to click on it and take a peek. And so click on the live streaming tab and just make sure that that custom live streaming service is there. And as long as it's there, you should be good. Alrighty, so now let's go over to our Facebook group. The easiest way to get into this is to start a new post. You're not actually going to create a post, but that's how you would do it. And then we go into live video. So basically what we're doing is we're, we're just kind of getting into the back end of, of things and uh, Facebook's functionality. And so this is where you click on go live. So we're not going to create an event. We're just going to click on go live. So this is what you would be doing when you're actually ready to go live. And uh, once we've got that, instead of webcam, you want to make sure you click streaming software. This is where you can put in your post details. So you just need a little bit of extra time to set things up at the beginning of your, your share. So for me, for my next live on Facebook uh, in my group, I'm going to just start about five minutes early. So I'll put my post details in here. And then you're going to want to grab this information. So you need your stream key and then under advanced settings, uh, I like to use a persistent stream key because that means that I can just use the same one over and over again. And so I can just kind of save this and use it for the future. So you're going to need your stream key and you're going to need your server URL. All right. So once you've got that information, uh, you'll also actually need the, the URL of your group as well. So I've got those pulled up here. Alrighty, so once you've got that set up in the back end, I want you to come over to Zoom again. And uh, this time you're going to go into the meeting that you want live stream. So you can, you can record it just like you normally would. You click on more. And instead of clicking on live on Facebook, you click live on custom live streaming service. So what we're going to do is get that set up in the broadcast tab here. All right, so let's see. 
So in this uh, space here, this is where you're going to put all of that information that you had on your stream key in your Facebook group. So grab your stream key, grab that server URL, you're going to copy it, move it over into uh, this, this page here. And so you want to make sure that the live streaming page URL is your Facebook group. And so I just grab that here move on over here and pasted it. And then you're going to click go live. And then that is going to take you instead of directly to going live, we're going to continue to prepare to live stream the meeting. And then it's going to take us into our live producer here, you're going to click on go live and you are good to go. So that's all that you need to know. It is, you know, a little bit of work around, I would suggest testing it because I have found some challenges with it already, uh, but it is something that will will help. Like it's it's the way to to deal with the challenge as it has arisen, and perhaps there will be more supports coming in the near future.